What have I done? Oh, we're good. We're good. Okay, game music could be louder. I thought so. I thought so. I'll turn it up a bit. Turn it up a bit. All right. Uh, welcome to Grandia. Welcome to Grandia. Um, episode one. Classic version. Yes. Classic version. Yes. We're going to, as per every game we play here, I'm going to read all the story. I'm going to listen to everything. I'm going to invest and we're going to enjoy. Um, the start button is the touchpad. So, oh fuck. Did I miss it? I waited too long. Maybe not. No, I did wait too long. Okay. Uh, new game. Do I have, uh, shit. Wait, is my category right? I think it is. No spoiling, no backseating. Good. I'm gonna pay attention to this shit. Japan. Yeah, CN, you can. Is this Japan? The flight, the, the flying islands of Japan? Oh, this music might need to be louder, though. Thanks, Tom. My grand Kia adventure. Keep them coming, Tom. Keep them coming. I guess I must have dozed off. I had that dream again. The bastards, they're hounding me. Mullen, where are we now? It's only been a half an hour since you asked last. You look tired, General Ball. I keep telling you, Mullen. And there are no soldiers around. You should call me father. Excuse me, but Lieutenant Lean is still here. <laughs> oh, it's just like you to answer like that. But you know that Lean is a very special part of our military plans, aren't you, Lean? The third excavation of the salt runes is almost finished. I'm counting on you, too. Mullen, lean. 
Lean has nothing to say. We've assigned an elite battalion of our forces to this excavation. You getting good guy vibes from this one? I'm sure that we'll hear good news. The current time is 1340 hours. Now passing through Parm airspace. Our ETA is 1530 hours. Lean. Open the viewports for General Ball. Yes, Colonel Mullen. Yeah, I'm sure this is the hero of our tale. It's the eye patch for me. Did I make it to Ontario for Easter? No space. I have not been to Ontario for a while. Oh, this is giving me like Xenogears vibes though. I'm gonna say it wrong. You know it. Plus ultra. Plus ultra. Cal, thank you for the three months. This girl. This girl's one of the main girls. She's. She was in the art. She's in the art for this game. This girl's important. It's a really early title screen, though, isn't it? Hey, you. This will teach you, you punk. Oh. Oh, Justin. Justin? Not you again. You just don't learn trashing my shed again. I didn't trash it. Why won't you listen to me? I'm staking my pride as a man and my soul as an adventurer on this treasure hunt. Shut up. There's no treasure in all that junk. Now you've completely trashed it. Oh. Anyway, don't ever hunt for treasure in my shed again. You hear me, boy? Did, am I? Is Justin Ouch. a child? Did he just smack down a child? That awful man, he never ever understands. Justin! Justin, Justin! You okay? What's the flying that thing? like it hurt. Oh, Sue, did you see that? Don't worry. A punch like that? Nothing to it. For a first-rate adventurer, it comes with the territory. Right. So how'd it go? Did you find anything in the shed? Nah, nothing at all. It really was all junk. Must have guessed wrong. But Sue, what about you? Of course I found something. Ta-da! What is that? Here it is, the legendary Oh. Get subscribed or get that. Oh. oh yeah. Puppy helps too. Here you go, Justin. The legendary armor. Dirty apron Great, acquired. Sue. That's the first one. That leaves the shield of light, the warrior's helmet, and the spirit sword. Ooh, no oxygen. Don't Thomas. forget! We gotta get him by sundown, or we'll lose! Hmm. Yuck, I don't want to marry that awful god! You know, it's really your fault, Justin. 
you're the one that took Gons up on his dare, you'd better take responsibility. Okay, I know, I know. Come on, let's go show this to Gons. Puffy, let's go too. <laughs> what is Puffy? Is it a moth? We found it, Gons. Hi, the Polly. Treasure. Thank you so much. I'm I'm glad that you were feeling better. I saw that you were feeling all right yesterday. It's nice to see you. Okay, uh, is this whole yeah? I wasn't expecting. I wasn't expecting voice acting. Is this whole thing voice acted? Okay, so I'm Justin. This is Sue. Classic RPG names. Um, in this house, we stand puffy. I mean, I'm I'm ready. You know. You know I love a little sidekick character. You know it. Um, okay. Not that much space. Okay, it fades off a bit. Not entirely. So, someone wants to marry Sue. Gantz wants to marry Sue? <laughs> if it isn't Justin, taking your sweet time, aren't you? First-rate adventurer? Shamenturer? The end of the world was found, and there's no use for adventurers. You're way behind the times. The end of the world was found? <laughs> it's the mayor. I know, I heard it, Demo. I heard it too. Uh, Polly, I assume you've played this. You've played two as well. Look, I like voice acting. It's fun. It's fun. There is no end of the world. Huh? You don't even know that. You're a first-rate adventurer? There's no way you're gonna find the four treasures before sundown. Is this Gantz? This duel is as good as one. As you promised, starting tomorrow, Sue's in my gang. I, Gantz, will take her as my bride. No way, Gantz. We've got plenty of time before sundown. Hey, Gantz, looky here. Shows the dirty apron to Gantz. Ah, you found the legendary armor. Haha, <laughs> how about that? Okay, so we gotta find the rest of the pieces of this shit, of, of this stuff. Uh, and then she doesn't have to join his gang by marrying him. Okay, where are we? Also, what is this? What do we got here? Standard reverse, stereo mono, vibration. This is, the, these are our only options. Okay. Let's explore. I love a game that starts with a protagonist promising a female friend as a bride to a rival gang. They lost a bet. Can I read this? No soliciting. This way to the cafe. Okay. The cafe. <laughs> I hate it when I'm forced into a gang through marriage. Yeah. House number three. We found house number three. I think a lot of people... I think a lot of people have been waiting for me to play Grandia. Hello? Glad to see you, Justin. I know why you're here. You want to hear fairy tales, right? Well, which one do you want to hear today? Tell me the happy adventurer. Once upon a time, there was an adventurer who traveled the world and picked up lots of treasure. But this kind-hearted man gave all his treasure to the poor. Everyone said he was a fool, but to this man, the only true treasure was the adventure itself. The man continued his adventures and lived a happy life ever after. The end. Okay, do you have any? Uh, I would like things. I'm looking for things. Lady? Oh, Justin, have you come to listen to Gramps' stories again? I'm amazed you don't get sick of hearing the same stories over and over. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, I need to. I need a Sue voice. I need a Sue voice. <laughs> Once again, you maintain the tradition of missing the start of a new game. What's the gist on this one? Uh, we are children looking for armor stuff so that um, Sue here doesn't have to marry a gang leader. That's it. Xenia, hello. Welcome in. How was your stream today? 
How was your stream? I, I admit I was surprised to see you live on Wednesday, but very happy to see you. Hi, Groovich. Hi, Dapper. Hi, Ali. Welcome in. Welcome in. What were you, what did you end up playing today, Xenia? Bonus stream. Oh, I love it. I love that. Thank you so much for bringing your community here. Friends, if you don't know me, hello. Hello. I'm Leandra. We play RPGs here. I just started this game uh, like 10 minutes ago. 10 minutes ago. Um, just, just started. So I don't really know what's happening. But we're doing it. But we're doing it. Oh, right. Sue has a mascot friend. Puffy. Puffy? Big <laughs> shit caps lock. No worries. No worries. Dapper, your dream is to marry a gang leader? Well, I, I, I think we can make that happen. I think we can make it happen. Uh, okay, right, yes. There were also some men on an airship that were talking about an excavation. Uh, his name was Ball, which is just great. I love it when a, a man's named Ball. Rick, thank you for the six months. Womp. 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 Um, did you go to Japan yet? Yeah, I just got back. It's my first, my first stream back. I actually spent the first hour of the stream going through a G Japan recap. I showed all my pictures and stuff. Yeah. Ball, lean, and melon. No Oxford comma. Just like the game, Hunter. Just like the game. Hi, Night Sprite. Welcome in. Saber. A grand beer return for Doc. Saber, thank you for the 16 months. Thank you very much. Um, Ed, hi. How are you? How are you doing? Xenia, did you say what you were playing? I, th I thought I heard you talking about Mario 64, but I don't know if you actually got into Mario 64, but let us know. Friends, if you're not following Xenia, please do that right now. Thank you. I assume you all pushed the button. Mario 64, are you doing all stars? Are you doing an all stars run? Let us know. Let us know what you're up to. Okay. Even if he hears it over and over, Justin still forgets it. Tee hee. Okay, we gotta get some stuff. Just for funsies? That's good. That's good. I have a couple people who would like me to play that game because they want to see me suffer. Um, but I think it's a bad idea. All right, that's house number three. I don't have a map, right? There's no... Oh, who are you? Oh, no. I'm busted. It's Justin. Who are you? Wasn't that Tense who just ran away? Too bad he's Gantz's little brother. Otherwise, he's pretty cute. You think so? I guess he's a lot better than Gantz. Who are you? What am I doing? Do I have a map? Hello? Oh, if it isn't you, Justin, you mustn't be playing all day. This is the age of learning. You must study diligently or be left behind the advance, or be left behind the advance of science. You're just always playing around. Yo, I can't stand this guy. I don't like studying either. Bye bye. Hey, young man, listen to me. Okay. I'm gonna get so lost in here. Uh, we gotta find house number one and two, I guess. This is the city of weird hats. I mean, look at my hat. I mean, hers is not a hat, right? Hers is a fee. Can I go here? I was looking at the the, um, the thing in the top corner, wondering if it was pointing me towards a location, but I don't think it is. It, it seems to like spin continuously. Okay, this is house number two. Japan was really good, Dapper. Um, I saw so many things. I ate so many things. I could never have steak again. I could never have sushi again. Both those things are ruined for me because they were just the best in Japan. <clears throat> a first-rate lady should be able to play an instrument like this as a sign of good breeding. Don't give me that. It's much more important to polish my swordsmanship. When a monster comes after you, this thing won't be any use at all. If you're not an adventurer, that's not a worry. The food there was amazing. Yeah, nothing, nothing will ever be the same again. You vaguely remember Grandia 3. 
Yeah, I, I would. I think maybe just the important scenes will be voiced. Did my mom tell you? My daddy's gonna be coming back on his ship pretty soon. He bought us a lot of gifts and is coming back from a place called New Parm. Wow, gifts from the new continent of Valencia? Maybe he'll give me something too. Justin, don't be so rude, but I guess I wish I could have something from the new continent too. Oh, hello Justin. Can you guess why I was so happy today? Well, if it were Aunt Lily, then her special disc dish came out perfect. What? That's right. If a new dish comes out well, Mom gives me extra allowance. <laughs> Not quite. My sailor husband is coming back from the new continent soon. Heart emoji. Do you have anything that I can steal, though? I need things. Is this old man just sitting here drinking? Dear Clara, Mom and Dad have gone to a party again today. So me and my kitty Chummy are house-sitting on the rose-scented balcony. Excitement fills the night air. What are you doing, sir? Uh, what? It's just you, Justin. I'm writing a letter. A letter. Huh? He's, he is drunk, right? Like, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna sit here. I'm not gonna sit here and tell you I know what's going on yet, because I don't. Not yet. But there is another house here, and we're going into it. This is house number four. We have not found house number one yet. <laughs> that husband of mine must be wandering around somewhere. He pilfered money from my purse and must be gambling somewhere again. But ma'am, why are you so angry? I just can't help it. My husband lost his job and goes gambling every day. Divorce him? The only RPGs that actually punish you for stealing are Skyrim and Dragon's Dogma. Um, Baldur's Gate. Baldur's Gate, like, does not like you to steal. Was this house number three? Have I gone in a circle? Oh, it can't go here. What? How did I zoom like that? Oh, this is Gans's house. Star Ocean 2 punishes you for stealing. Same, that's what I said, Dapper, when this loaded up. This feels very Xenogears. Even this city reminds me of Ooh, I don't know I don't remember the place the name of anywhere. But the city reminds me of one of the cities in Xenogears. Well, if it isn't Justin, weren't you playing with my little Gantz? Gantz and the others are down at the bridge by the factory. Right now we're right in the middle of a duel to hunt for the four hidden treasures. Well, well. I'm glad you never get tired of playing every day, but don't make trouble for anyone. I don't even know where to look. Like, is this an actual chest I can open? <gasps> Here's Gantz's treasure chest. He put a lock, a lock on it, so there must be something important inside. Well, pick the lock. Come on, puppy! Hi! Dex! Dex bonus and raiders. Welcome in. Welcome to the stream. It is nice to have you all. Hello, Tamber. Hello. How was your stream? What? What is Harold Halibut? I feel like I saw someone playing that recently. Raiders, hi. Welcome in. If you don't know me, my name is Leandra. We mostly play RPGs here, mostly retro RPGs, and mostly first playthroughs of retro RPGs. A claymation game. Oh, I actually, I freaking love claymation and stop motion as like, as an art. Um, Hayes loves tacos. Welcome in. I also love tacos. Midwinter Lily. Hello. It is nice to have you. Wendon, welcome in. 
Welcome in. Have I played Re Legend of Dragoon? I have played Legend of Dragoon. If you go exclamation point list, you will see a uh, not up to date list of the games I have played. It's mostly up to date. Mostly up to date. Port Road. Uh, we just started Grandia today, right now. Thank you for the thank you for the follows. Follows here are anonymous, so it is always up to you whether you want to participate or not. Um, Saber, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Dex Bonus. It's very kind of you. Very, very kind. Is it enjoyable? I've played um, like half an hour, maybe 20 minutes. We've just started it, so I don't know yet. I don't know, but it was suggested by chat, voted in by chat to be played, so I'm hoping, I'm hoping we have a good start here. Hmm. Who's behind this? Sticking these flyers on the walls of other people's houses? Ah, I know. It must have been you, Justin. New followers, welcome and thank you so much for the follows. Thank you. I appreciate it so much. It is wonderful to meet you. Me Meta! Hey, welcome in, Meta. How are you? Ah, I know. It must have been you, Justin. Huh? It wasn't me. Look in these eyes. Are these lying eyes? No. Wait, what? Ah! Here we can see the puffs of smoke from the factory, Puffy's favorite. Okay, let's look a little. Oh, that was a very little. We looked a very little. I am lost. Oh, it's you, Justin. You playing with Gantz again? You guys are really good friends. Me and Gantz? Good friends? I'm having a duel with him. Also, he wants to marry this girl. Oh, fuck. I did go in a circle. I found nothing. Okay, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Let's, uh... We didn't... What house was this? Did I go into this house? This is house number five. I don't know what I'm doing here. Hey, cat soul, how are you today? Happy Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. Well, glad to see you two. Full of energy as always. <laughs> but Justin is just too full of energy. He just got scolded. Uh, well, yeah. I guess I did. But I did it to beat Gantz. Oh, it's you two. Justin and little Sue. Come to hear a story today. Sorry, Graham. No time for that now. I'll be back as soon as I settle things with Gantz. Hang on till then. Okay. We gotta find some shit. We're on the lookout for the legendary... Legendary equipment? We have one piece of it. I didn't do that myself. I've accomplished nothing, so let's just keep talking to people. We're playing hide-and-seek. Say, Justin. Are you playing hide-and-seek with Gaunts, too? Huh? Why do you say that? I'm having a duel with Gaunts. We're not playing hide-and-seek. That's so? Well, then why did Gaunts climb down into the canal? He's sneaking around doing something. I thought it was hide-and-seek. Can I go into the canal? Oh. <gasps> Wait, this is something. Say, Justin, you think this pot could be the warrior's helmet? Yeah, I think you're right. This must be the warrior's helmet. <laughs> Just you wait, Gaunts. Yes, okay. I did it. We've done a thing. Battered pot acquired. <gasps> wait, where's... Who is this? Who's talking? It's him again. I better run. Run! What's up with tents? What do you think, Justin? You think if I follow this child, he will leave me? Shit, where do you go? No, this is house number three. I've been in house number three. Any hints? Promise, Justin? Don't tell anyone that I'm hiding you, okay? Playing hide and seek, huh? What should I do? Maybe I'll rat you out to it. Justin, don't be so mean. But you gotta find a better hiding place or you're gonna get found. Yeah, you're literally just standing in an alley, sir. Is it Lahan? Is Lahan the place that it's reminding me of? 
<clears throat> Say, Justin, I heard you're playing a treasure hunt game with Gantz. You're not gonna lose out to Gantz, are you, Justin? That Gantz is no problem. <laughs> He's staring at the wall. If you can't see them, they can't see you. That feels right. Just like you, Justin. You're so confident. That's what I like about you. <laughs> You're all counting on me. I just gotta win. Uh, I should pretend to be more confident. All right. We're talking to everybody. That's how we get hints. Ah, nothing to do. There's nothing more boring than when we get and when you get found in hide and seek. I gotta keep standing here till she finds everyone. Anyway, what you doing, Justin? Glad you asked. I'm having a duel with Gantz. I would, I ask about the hidden things. I, who are you, lady? I've been seeking for so long, but I still haven't found anybody. Being it in hide and seek is tough. That's right, Pippi. You're so gentle natured, so maybe you're not cut out to be it. We should totally tell her that that guy's hiding there. Oh no, I've been in here. Do you think there's one in that chest, maybe? Okay, right, wait, wait, wait. We were hugging the left and kind of following that child. Is it you? It's you. Oh no, I'm busted. It's Justin. No. No, I've already had this text. Okay. This is not, that's not it. Can I read these signs? Good coffee and beautiful women. Yes, this must be what they mean by truthful advertising. It's true that Miss Carolyn, no, Curlian? Miss Curlian is beautiful, but Justin, you haven't even tasted the coffee. I would, I would like, the, how do I get the coffee? In here? Hmm, it's closed. Say, Justin, why do you think Miss Curlian's place is always closed? It says right here, open only at night. You don't have to read to me. Even I can read that. I'm not a kid anymore. I apologize? <gasps> oh, I had a good feeling. Hey, pal in Genesis. How are you? This is your favorite PS1 RPG. I am excited to play it. We, I've done nothing. I've done almost nothing. That wasn't helpful. Open only at night. <laughs> Nighttime only coffee seems legit. Oh gosh. Okay. Oh dear. What do I do, Sue? I might be moving away. What? Really? Yes. Mommy and Daddy were talking about it. Can I talk to these men? What do you want? The bridge is closed now. Come on, go away. Don't you know that General Ball and, and Colonel Mullen are about to come across? I guess it was Mullen, wasn't it? Hey, original, how are you? Good morning. Good morning, nice to have you. How's your Wednesday going? Well, it doesn't matter. Until we square things up with Gantz, we shouldn't be going to South Parm. This man with a hat wasn't helpful. Hello? Ah, it's too peaceful here. The Garlisle forces can't be much, or can't be of much use sitting around the town of Harm. Excavating ruins isn't work for a soldier. Soldiers are pretty useless now. Should have become an engineer. I hear there's a few places on the new continent of Alencia where the Garlisle forces can be useful. Uh, this is the, I'm playing on PS, or PS5. So PS5 port. Hey P, welcome in. Happy Wednesday. I'm doing very well, thank you. I'm happy to be back streaming. I'm excited to start a new game. How are you? How have you been? Hey Justin, did you hear? That 
crazy and veteran self parm has invented something else again. That inventor won't stop, but it sounds interesting. Maybe I should go see him. You're about the only one who goes to visit that guy. Oh. Yeah, I did. I did. I mean, I'm waiting. I'm kind of waiting to, like, hit a wall. Uh, Sleep-wise. I mean, I got a good night's sleep. Why do I want this to be something? No, I don't want to talk to you. I got a good night's sleep last night and the night before. Um, I already talked to this lady. Don't worry about it. But I don't know. I still woke up. I woke up at like 1.30 and I woke up at 2.30. Um, so we'll see. I feel okay. I feel okay to like time zone wise. Why not the Saturn version? Uh, I just, this was available to me. I don't know. This is free on PS Plus. I didn't, I didn't have to pay any more money. That's why. And, and I also can't read Japanese. You're right. I can't read Japanese. All right, I feel like I've been almost everywhere. That's not a place I can go. That's not a place I can go. Uh, it was so good, KP. It was really, really great. I had a wonderful time in Japan. It was so busy, um, but I mean, I knew it was gonna be busy because I wanted to do all the things. <clears throat> but, um, Oh yeah, I guess I didn't say this yet. So I have like, like a Garmin watch that I wear um, and I tracked all my steps. And I think in total across the trip, we did something like a hundred and, a hundred and like 50 kilometers of walking. Wait, where am I? Where did I just go? Port. Well, this will be good, I think, right? This port's the one you played. The remaster has Japanese voice text, or voice and text that are good for practicing. Justin has a bit of a foul mouth. All right. Oh, wait, is this a save? Oh, this must be what a save looks like. Touch. Save game. There's a hint system. Good. Ooh, I'm curious about that hint system. You got a lawnmower. What kind of lawnmower did you get? I ask because we have been talking about getting a new, getting a new lawnmower. Hey, Chaos. Hello. Welcome in. Japan was wonderful. That's that's her name. Yeah, this is Justin and Sue. Justin and Sue. I ask because we were uh, talking about whether we should get a gas or a battery powered lawnmower you, you got a bat a battery power one did you have a battery power one before or are you moving from from like gas to battery hey you kids passengers only beyond this point come on go home ah uh, come on i just want to look for something can i come in for a little bit <gasps> he didn't stop me he didn't stop me the first one you're moving from gas to battery Where did you go when you went, KP? <gasps> this, I want this. Could this be the pot lid? Uh, could this pot lid be the shield of light? Hey, know what? It does look like a shield. Come on, let's pick it up. Pot lid acquired. Oh, you've never had a lawnmower before. Oh, you forgot I finished Final Fantasy III? We did go long. I mean, we were still on um, still on subathon time. Um, so I, I played for like eight hours. Chaos, last stream. Oh, is that pot lid yours? Did you bring it from the kitchen of Lily's Seagull Restaurant? Hmm? Isn't it sort of dirty to be Lily's? No, no, this isn't mom's. Is Lily my mom? The PP is officially over. Unofficially, the PP leaves on or lives on. I did think about removing the PP emote, but I didn't do it. Morgan has a battery powered one. It works well enough for a small yard without too many leaves. I just, I, I, our lawnmower, 
works well. It is a gas-powered lawnmower. It works well. I mean, it's getting old. Um, it's just annoying to have to go and to have to fill it, you know? But I've heard that they generally work better than um, than battery-powered ones. I don't know. It's, it's, it's a, a fence I'm currently sitting on. Something for future Leandra. Ah, I love the sea. Horizon as far as you can see. Uninterrupted white caps. When I look at the sea, I feel refreshed, as if it washes my body and soul. But his back is covered with seagull droppings. Ew, you're right. Okay, gross. Can I go here? Oh, nice. Justin, looking at the sea today? Be careful of the handrails. They're old and fragile. Hey, I know all about him. Huh? How do you know that? Haha. <laughs> Must have been the one who broke the handrail. Oh, rats. Busted again. I just climbed onto the handrail to try to see the new world and snap. <gasps> I want to do this. I want to do this. You're going to Japan for your honeymoon. Oh, yeah. I mean... Whatever, Curling. Doesn't matter if they don't recognize it. <clears throat> uh, da, da, da. PP forever. PP forever, indeed. Okay. Justin, jumping on the handrail again? It's gonna break. Don't worry, let's look, Sue. PP forever. Neat. I like those little like perspective things, like the look around, the little look around. Get subscribe or get out. Oh. <laughs> okay, I think that's funny, but also if you do it while the ad is running, I don't know, you know, collapse your PP for storage. Okay, I uh, oh, can I go here? Could I have gone through that door? Wait a second, I didn't even try. I need one more thing still, right? What is this? Okay, I guess not. We got a lid. We got the lid, the shield lid. We got the pot. We got the apron. Maybe that's all the things I need? Tokyo, Osaka, Kyoto, Nara, and I don't know how to say that one. What's that, uh, what is, what's, where is that last city? I went to the other one. Hameoka, Hameoka, maybe? Oh, sword, the sword, we need the sword. Wait, wait, where did I just come from? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. It's ready to use when you need it. You threw it in the trunk of a Honda Civic and did another yard a few times. I like the idea. I like the idea of a battery powered lawnmower. Just so that I don't have to like run to a gas station. Duel of the century. Gantz, defender of justice versus Justin the coward. <laughs> oh fuck. The hunt for four treasures begins. What is this? It says Justin the Coward. Gans is in for it now. That's right. Why it doesn't even have my name or Puffy's name either. It's pretty rude. You're totally missing the point, Sue. I mean, she's not. She's also, she's important. Okay, we need a sword. How do I get a sword? All of the other stuff has just been like sitting around. But, um, do you think it's what's in the chest at Gonza's house? Maybe? I don't, I, I don't remember where his house is. Or how to pick locks, so. Oh, here's his house. Do you have an upstairs?
I remember that Gaunt's getting spanked by his mom with this mop. Hee hee. Justin, didn't you get whacked by Aunt Lily with Trey? You too. You still behave like children. Yeah, I would like to break this box. I don't think I can. Just press triangle for the first time. Status, good. Status, good? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. I mean, you can do exclamation backseating or exclamation point um, spoilers. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I'm, yeah, I talk to myself a lot. Status, good. Uh, so please don't help me. Please let me suffer. Oh, are there spell slots? MP level one, level two, level three. Where's the spell slots? Items, equipment, magic. Magic? Show me your magic. Skill. I don't think he has any. Wait, do you have magic? No magic. Thank you for the follow. St status, chillin'. I'm good. Um, yeah, the safe word is flamingo. If you, if you, um, hear me drop a flamingo, that means I actually want you to answer me. Moves. Show me your moves. Level one moves. Uh, no, it's no moves. Um. 8 MP and nothing to spend it on. Items? Wound cell. I assume that's like a healing potion. Wood pole, cut board, goggles, adventure armor, sneakers, hero badge. She's got sweets? I think that's for like MP. No HP. Uh, I beg to differ. Tell me that's not cherries. Banana? That's cherries. Okay, so these are just varying levels of healing. Status? Oh, we have weapon levels. Okay. Okay. That's definitely bananas. Why is banana cherries? I don't know. Maybe all fruit are just cherries. Okay, but I don't have a key for this, so... I... Did I just touch that plant? Look at this. I moved the plant. Okay. I can touch everything. Those were two very stunted red bananas. You spent too long in Japan if you don't recognize a good American banana anymore. There was absolutely a lack of lack of fruit. I have not eaten very much fruit at all in the past week and a half. I did have the strawberry sandwiches, which I loved. They're like strawberries, uh, custard, and whipped cream on white bread. You'd think it's weird, but it's not. It's great. Have a strawberry sando from 7-Eleven. They're, they're wonderful. Okay, where's this fucking sword? House four, I think I've been in here. But I still haven't found house number one. Also saw the most expensive strawberries I've ever seen in my life. In my life. We went to the market, the, the, the like, the fish market in, in Tokyo. You could buy, I think it was like six strawberries for $15. What the hell? What the hell? What? Wh how? Those, I, I didn't buy them. I didn't buy them. I can't afford that. $15 for six strawberries? They, be right, they better be the best strawberries ever in the world. Okay, where's this fucking sword? <laughs> it's a strawberry, what could it cost? Like $10? What's a banana cost? Like $10? I don't think I need to go there.
I mean, I have no way to advance the time to night, so I can't go to that other place. Wait, can I go here? I don't think I can go here. They would have turned me into a magical girl. They also had, like, white strawberries. And I don't know what was special about them, but they had strawberries of, like, yeah, the different palenesses. So you could buy the red ones, like, super red, and then you could buy ones that were kind of pink, and then you could buy white ones. But they were really expensive. it. Uh, actually, can you tell me the other story? Maybe the other story has a hint. Yeah, I do want to hear a story. Maybe the prince and the princess? Once upon a time, an evil wizard cast a spell upon a prince and turned him into stone. The prince's fiance, the princess of the next kingdom, became so sad that she cried from dawn to dusk. But oddly enough, the tears of the princess fell on the prince and broke the spell. The evil wizard was cast out of the kingdom, and the prince and princess lived happily ever after. Thank you for the follow. Thank you for the follow. <laughs> the prince's fiance. Fiance. Um, yeah, right, Tutson? I don't know. <clears throat> the prince's Beyonce, his own personal Beyonce. Such a romantic story. I'd like to fall in love with a handsome prince. Do you have a sword, though? They sell individual strawberries for like $500 each. It's a lot, a lot of strawberries. A lot of expensive strawberries. Maybe I go tell him... Maybe there's like a next leading clue if I'm like, Yo, I got two of the things. Also, haven't I already won? I have two of the- I have three of the four items. Like, you, you can't even win. Wait, what? I- Don't I have three of them? <laughs> I knew you were a third-rate adventurer. You've only found one of the hidden treasures. Well, when I show you these, you gotta admit that I'm first-rate pants. Shows the battered pot and pot lid to pants. Ugh, you found the warrior's helmet and the shield of light. I guess you got three of the four treasures, but don't let it go to your head. You won't find the last one. The spirit sword's so easy, Justin. Huh, the spirit sword? Piece of cake. Then I'll win, Gantz. But we didn't see anything like a sword anywhere. That's true. You're never going to find the spirit sword. No matter what, there's no way you'll find it. Nah. Justin, thanks a lot. Anyway, if you get one more, I can go take a nap. I guess you're not even interested in this hunt for the four treasures, right? I was hoping one of them... I was hoping one of them might have a key to that treasure chest. If you... Oh, gosh. It's him again. I better run. What's up with tents? Does it have to do with tents? Maybe if I approach him from the other angle? No, he just, does he just keep running back and forth? Okay. Same text. Same text. Let's go find him again. Tents? Wait, shit. Tents? No, he just goes back and forth. <clears throat> I heard Princess Beyonce as well. Beyonce taking over country. <laughs> taking over country and now she's taking over countries. Okay. Uh, hmm. I mean, look. Beyonce is very powerful. She deserves it. She deserves countries. Oh. Where's the fucking sword? Rick's over here. Like, I know where that sword is. She's never gonna find it. It's not in the garbage. <gasps> Wait, now I know. Oh, is this like a, is this a girls club? Is this a lady club? Look at that lady on the sign. Oh, 
Only open at night. Coffee and ladies. Can I read this? Huh? This sign says something, but the letters are so small. Uh, what does it say? If you're feeling nauseous, please come this way. Ew, yuck. What's this smell? Could it be... Wait, is this a vomit in here? This is vomit? Hey, Echo. How are you today? <gasps> okay, I don't care about you, Tense. Looks like she's backing it up. She's just, she's doing a bend and snap. That's the bend part of the bend and snap. Okay, that girl says her, she's moving away. Uh, I mean, look, worst case, I could go to the hint location. I just, I've been everywhere. Haven't I been everywhere? Coffee. It's, it's adult coffee, probably. These are fake doors. It, this is too intense. What's this? Nothing? Can you talk to me? They say the future of our forces and the world depends on the salt runes operation. At least that's what General Ball says. Anyway. But still, I never thought I'd be digging holes. Say, Justin, isn't salt the ruins of an ancient civilization? Why is the army investigating it? I don't know shit. I really don't know shit. Oh. I'm gonna see what this says. I'm gonna go to the, the hint thing. Tell me about the sword. Oh, does this heal maybe? Hint. Oh, no, this isn't hints. This is like tutorial. The compass at the top right of the screen has a red mark showing north. The compass needle points to the destination. Spinning faster, the closer you get to the destination. This is actually very helpful. You can press the L2 R2 button to change the destination settings. Changing the destination settings makes the compass needle point to another entrance or exit of the dungeon. Remember that you cannot change the destination in town. Okay, wait. Okay, that's a, I, I mean, is that a slow? Is that a slow revolve? back into the city and see if it spins faster. It's still pretty slow. Okay, let's tour. Who's this man? I'm in the young men's club. Can't you see that Parm's full of activity? It keeps on developing. The time for youth has come. That's what the Young Men's Club is for. How about it? Want to join, Justin? Um, I think I'll pass. If I joined, I couldn't go adventuring when I wanted. Join the Young Men's Club. Okay, I'm just gonna wander and look at that compass in the top corner and wait till it spins crazy. Same. What, like, what if I go up to Gans' house and look at that chest? As if I remember where he lives. Spin for me. Spin for me, compass needle. Oh, I can't see it when I'm inside. You don't think it's doing anything? How was it? How was it, Jackson? Since that got mentioned, like before I left for, for Japan, I've seen that game everywhere now. Do so you think the compass isn't working? <gasps> do you see this this building here? How do I can I get up on that bridge? I think I can. Nah. I don't know what I'm doing. The hint the hint even didn't help. Okay, 
Okay, I tried this. <laughs> jiggles. Not the jiggles, Jackson. Why would you want to ignore the jiggles? Embrace the jiggles. I don't think this thing's changing. It's spinning at the same rate regardless of where I'm standing. It's Sekiro with boobs. Yeah, nah. This isn't working, is it? Are they pairing with the boobs? The boobs are the part of the strategy. <clears throat> I think I talked to you already. Can I talk to my friend though? Like, lady, Sue, do you have any ideas? <laughs> I'm sure you can spec into boob jits boob jitsu. Wonderful. That's wonderful. I would imagine it kind of like, well, I would want the I'm thinking about Katy Perry, okay? I'm thinking about Katy Perry. Um, wasn't there like a music video where she had like a bra that, was it whip, did it do whipped cream or something? And that's the weapon. But then also, they could just be titty guns, right? Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm thinking about Katy Perry respectfully. Respectfully, always respectfully. Hi, El Toro. Hello. Uh, Gaston truly was a great man. He won the Nobel Prize. I hope you're having a good week so far, El Toro. Hi, Soul Blazer. Grandy is a game you, you played and beat when it first came out, but you never thought of it since. Well, here we go. Yeah, I might play the second one if I like this, but I am having a problem with the very first. I can't. I'm, I'm having a problem with the very first quest. The very first quest line. I, I can't find a sword. I need a sword. None of these things are swords. I don't know what this, this tense dude wants. I can't help him. We all block this part out of our brain. That's right, tracksuit. That's exactly it. Am I gonna find this thing? Do, like, you you know where it is, right? Like if I, I, I touched a broom though. I just, just like knocked it over. I have touched a broom before. Like this could be a sword, right? This right here looks kind of swordy. I'd sword that. All the things that I'm looking for that have sparkled, right? So I'm looking for something that sparkles. Like, like Robin sparkles. <laughs> I'd, I'd sword that. I would, I'd hit someone with that. I'd use that to whack a person. Like, I, fuck. Like, is that, that, see, it's not sparkling. And I also just did vandalism. Um, I'd use this guitar as a sword. Okay, but I... I've already read this text. Just knocking over brooms, yeah. Just casual. This man is drinking. Nothing here is sparkling. I can't interact with any of this, actually. <laughs> hey, Rick. Yeah, I guess she's getting married. I guess she's getting married to Gantz. Yeah, join the gang. Join the gang, because I can't find a sword, so... Well, oh well. Sometimes it be like that. It's not gonna ruin your experience to flamingo this one. Am I even like close to the sword? Have I looked at the sword? Have I walked past the sword? Kind of. Where do you keep 
your swords. I really liked the idea of, um, you know when I talked to that dude up, up the lighthouse and he was like, yo, did, did you break this shit? Oh, can I go in here? No. He was like, yo, did you break this shit? And I was like, yeah, I'm strong. I thought that maybe if we broke off a railing, like, that could be a sword, but I think the sword already exists, right? I don't have to make it. Legit one of the worst parts of the game right here. Ah. Where is sword? I can't go in here. I can't go in there. Now, nah, this is the same shit. I don't think that's helping me here. I have indirectly walk walked past. I like how I asked if I've walked past the sword and I got a no, I got a yes, I got a kind of, and I got an indirectly. What about these alleys? Can't go down that way. We're so helpful. Do you think you walked past the sword? I, just, uh... I mean, I'm still kind of in half a mind of like the swords in the chest. You actually need a key to open the sword, to open the chest to get the sword. In fact, if I know, like, do I already have the sword? No, I don't have the sword. I have a pole. You remember why you never got into this game returned it? Is it this part right here, finding the sword, Lawrence? You never you never got, got past that? Be the sword. Feel the sword. I am one with the sword. Is there just a part of the map that I've missed? I don't think I can go that way. Oh, your no was to, uh, to am I close? Okay. I have returned from things. I'm now ready for your entire Japan recap from the beginning. Ragnats, I'm so sorry. Yeah, and there were no wikis. Mm -hmm. You just had to figure it out yourself. No wikis, no internets. You had to talk to your friends on the schoolyard. Did I read this sign? Yeah, I did. Fuck. No. I mean, is there like an advanced time mechanic? I think I read this. Good coffee, beautiful women. I don't know what's up with this child. Does it have anything to do with this child? Is the, does this kid have a sword? How long, how long have I been walking around? How long have I been walking around looking for a sword? I don't even know if I can interact with that kid. I tried approaching him from a different direction to uh, see if that did anything. It doesn't. He still run runs wait right past us. I don't know what he's about. I have no idea what you're doing, kid. 
<clears throat> Were you able to use any of the suggestions I made? Yeah. I mean, I, I, I used your suggestions to kind of make our itinerary. Um, I even had that restaurant on the itinerary. We just didn't make it there in time because we went knife shopping instead. We went knife shopping instead of their restaurant. Um, okay, can I have a, can I have like a small hint? Small, small hint for, ooh, I need to fix that. I need to fix that. Um, small hint, talk to Gantz. I already did. I already did. Where is he li I even talked to him after getting the other things. If only you'd gone sword shopping, I would love to go sword shopping. Okay, I thought it was. I thought it was. Listen close, Justin. The spirit sword is in the tre treasure chest in my house. But it's locked, so you can't open it. Here's the catch. Where do you think the key is? The key to the treasure chest? Hmm. Did I see something like that? Hey, Justin. Bet it's simple for an adventurer to open a treasure chest, right? If you can do it, don't you go around saying you're an adventurer. Deal? You're never gonna find... Okay, that's the same thing. Did you see anything like that? Did I see anything like a key to a treasure chest? I mean, I was low-key looking for a key to a treasure chest. This is its house, right? Is this, this text change? Just as I thought it's locked. Oh, okay. Say, Justin, why don't you ask Gans's mom about the key? Okay. Hi, Mom. The stew's ready. It's almost dinner time, but what are Gans and Tens doing? What, Justin? What do you mean? Do I know where the key to Gantz's treasure chest is? Oh, now I remember. Gantz gave it to Tents after lunch. Go we'll find Tents and ask him. The child. We go to the child. Uh, was the experience, experience life-changing? Yes. Largely because of the food. The food. I could talk about the food for a long time. It's like food. Go to Japan, eat the food. Where'd the kid go? Here he is. What do I do? What do I do? Ah! Hey, what's wrong, Tense? Why are you crying? I'll tell you, but... But will you promise not to tell Gantz? I can't if you don't tell me. Wow, oh no! Gantz is gonna kill me! Wah, somebody help me! What? 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 Why are both of these saying yes? Largely because of the food is right? Yeah. Why are both of these yes? Unless this is saying, no way I'll tell Gantz. But I read this as, no way, I'll tell Gantz. No, oh no, don't tell Gantz that I lost the key to his treasure chest. Hmm, now I see. You lost the key to the treasure chest holding the spirit sword. How? How did you know? Sue, can you read my mind or something? <laughs> Tense, you're so gullible. Come on, stop crying. We'll help you look for it. Right, Justin? I guess I have no choice. Okay, I'm gonna check the trash. Nope. Okay, so he dropped the key. That's it? He dropped it? while running, he was just running back and forth here. I mean, I've seen everywhere this kid has been. He went this way and then he went this way. He's so dense about the whole key thing. It's what you get for joining gangs. <laughs> found you. Ah, you found me. Wait a minute. When did you become it, Sue? <laughs> tricked you, tricked you. Don't scare me like that. Now I gotta find another hiding place. as he doesn't, proceeds to not move. 
Are we gods yet? No. No, I'm not even sure if uh, this, this world has a religion. Not sure yet. <clears throat> uh, CN? This is the JRPG? Where, look, I, I can't, it hasn't been introduced to me. It hasn't been introduced to me. Unsure if this is a religious society. Uh, where did that fucker drop this key, though? <laughs> Why does it do that? It, like, zooms in when I stand in that corner. If it doesn't have a religion, this sounds like an opportunity. Let's do it. The religion of Justin. I never want to assume anything. I don't want to assume anything. You never know. Each game is a new experience. Some are the same experience. <laughs> Power of friendship. That's right. Yes. <laughs> Should we take bets on where we're, when we're going to jail? How about, is there a sewer level? Are we going to the sewers in this game? God, what is this prediction? What's happened here? What has happened? In this stream, in this stream? Shit, we're going to, I can't even find the fucking key. <laughs> we're never leaving this city. Okay, do you think the kid went to the docks? We're never leaving Parm, let alone going to jail. Guards blocking a bridge, I say yes. How do I get to three? No, no. Doc seems jailable. Yeah, I'd send her to jail. Yeah, she looks like the kind of person that should go to jail. I'm on East Coast time. There's no judgment. There was no judgment here, Wombat. Do we think the kid's been up here? No. I assume it's gonna be sparkling. I'm looking for something sparkling. Status. Good. My status is good. Jackson. judgment just just in your head judgment silently judging me why can't she find the key I'm looking for a sparkle on the ground this kids just been want like running around I'm I'm happy he's giving me so much time though Okay, let's go talk to Gantz again. That was the answer before. It's almost sundown. Looks like I'm gonna win, Justin. Sue, you're gonna be in my gang. Let's try the square in front of the cafe again. We've got no time to waste. Okay. We were already in there. Oh, fuck. Wait, how did I... How did I crawl?
I have to assume we're in the we're in the the vomit, right? You have this game at home, Wendon? There you go. There you go. Yeah, we're in the vomit. Okay, is it under the book? Is it in Well, I just fell down near the river by the cafe. Okay, I bet it's still there. Let's look around down by the river. What? Hey, what's this? I found it. Yeah, that's it. Oh, I'm so glad you found it. Thanks, Justin and Sue. Hey, don't give it back, though. Well, what do you know? Tents can be so sweet. I'll never forget this, Justin. Well, I'll definitely remember until the day after tomorrow. <laughs> Look at you. You were bawling like a baby, and now you're back to the usual tents. Big Brother Gantz told me not to give this key to you, Justin, but you know... I'll give it to you anyway. I can't be indebted to anyone if I'm gonna be a man. Treasure chest key acquired. But Justin, you tell him that you took it from me by force, okay? Otherwise, Gans will beat me up. <laughs> the treasure chest holding the spirit sword is at my house. Come along with me, Justin and Sue. Oh, we did not. We didn't come along with Number three. Shit. This house? Chess is your house. Uh. No? Yes. All right. Picks. Hi. Welcome in. How you doing? How you doing? Happy Wednesday. Nice to see ya. <clears throat> Thank you so much. You want to run like that? Okay. Let's get it. All right, finally. Now we can open the treasure chest. I'm so excited. Justin, Puffy must be too. Puff, puff. Oh, I need to give Puffy a voice. Does Puffy, uh, I think probably just puff, puff, right? Puff, puff. Here goes. Here it is. This is a spirit sword. Wooden sword acquired. Yes, let's go. She doesn't have to get married. Hicks had an awesome Resident Evil game stream with jump scares. Hell yeah. Jump scares are good. Are good. Man, scary games on stream though. Why do you guys keep pulling these pranks all the time? Are you listening, Gantz? Look at that, Sue. Greg is telling Gantz off good. Huh, what a chump. We told Gantz to stop blocking the bridge. He really is stupid. It was Gantz who stacked those boxes on the bridge. So let's just act casual and walk by. We're gonna be casual. Uh, was Japan life-changing? It was. It was. I ate some of the best food of my life. It was also just not quite what I expected it to be. It was so, I mean, Tokyo itself was unreal. It Just because of how big it was and how many people were there. Charlie, hello. Tell my big bro you just beat me up, Justin. Yeah, that'll work. Huh? Wait a second, Justin. Weren't you two playing together with Gantz too? Surely you just. There's no way I'd be caught dead playing with Gantz. That's right, Greg, sir. We just happen to be passing by, right, Puffy? Puff, puff, puff. Of course you wouldn't. There's no way that I, Gantz, would be playing with Justin. Me and Justin are having a duel. What? What's the meaning of this, Justin? B -b busted Make a break for it, Sue. Oh. Where are we going? <laughs> ah, we made it. But he didn't have to get that mad, right, Sue? It's just that all the regular things you do are bad. That's why no one believes you. I, I also preferred Kyoto. I preferred Kyoto to Osaka as well. It was just so much more chill. So much more chill. Less people. Oh, 
Oh, who's this lady? Hello? Is this my mom? Hey, Justin! Ouch! Mom! It's my mom. What did I do? How many times do I have to tell you? No dirty shoes in the kitchen. Even so, you don't have to hit me with your tray. Don't talk back to me. You know the rules of Seagull Restaurant. Always keep the kitchen clean. Come on, I have work to do. Out you go. My little troublemaker. You could at least help if you're going to be in the kitchen. Hello, Aunt Lily. If you keep whacking Justin's head, he's gonna get stupid. <laughs> Don't worry, Sue. Justin's brain can't get any worse than it already is. That's my mom. Mom, I'm hurt. How could you say such things about your only darling son? <laughs> well, why don't you just be good so I don't have to, hmm, Justin? I've been getting in trouble all day today. My mom doesn't believe in me. Oh no! Of course he's a jerk. I don't think Greg was a jerk. Um, I mean, he's just like an authority person. I don't, it's fine. Ooh. Okay, wait, what do I... Why do I... Why am I here? <laughs> Yikes. Oh, what's this? What this? Stashing place. Oh. Oh, uh, this, this screams limited inventory size to me. But we shall see. Starfish, cheese, eggs, potatoes, surprise mushrooms. What's this? Oh, that's right, her shopping list. Funny place for mom to put it. Also, surprise mushrooms? Flashbacks to Lunar. <laughs> What's in the chest? Yeah, this is it. Gotta have this on an adventure. An adventure can't be forgetting. Adventurer can't be forgetting such an important thing. First aid kit acquired. Anyone here eating starfish? Never. I've never even heard of people eating starfish. Do people eat starfish? Oops, I almost forgot. I kept some money hidden here. I'm glad mom didn't see this. She's always saying, waste not, want not. How much money? Why does money always run out so fast? Sames. This world is so realistic. Wait, is this a sword? Also, what's this thing? How much money did I get? I had 200. 100. Oh, you can't use that sword? Oh. Hi, Jake. Hello. What's up? Boom, shake the room. DOC. What in Sam hell is going on around here? What in the Sam hell is going on around here? We're, we've started Grandia. We're doing Grandia. This is my room. I don't know what I'm doing here. I don't know what I'm doing here. Jake, thank you for the 100 bits, though. How you been? How you been? What's up, XPS? Good to have you. Quick math. Thank you, Charlie. I am to impress. Uh, I wonder if I just put those things in here though. Part of me is like, part of me is like drop that shit. Like what if this doesn't scroll? Oh wait, can I equip these things? Can 
I equip them? Yeah. Okay, so the, the sword was good, but the other two things, not good. You know what, I'm just gonna carry them until I get into trouble and regret it. So, that's how we play here. We play until we regret. Doing works, drinking beers, pole dancing for fitness, skiing, skiing. Hmm, a little bit past skiing time. Yeah, I'm not sure why the banana is a cherry. We did talk about that. Wait, Justin, if we go now, they'll catch us. I, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Mom? Getting in trouble? Justin! Now, just what were, were you doing today? Listen, Justin, I won't get mad, so tell me the truth. Yeah, you will. Even if I tell the truth, you still get mad all the time. Don't give me that. Have you ever really told me the truth? Come on now, tell me straight. What exactly were you doing today? I'm just gonna say I was busy. What's wrong, what's wrong with pole dancing? There are people who do pole dancing. That's a legit thing. I've been busy since morning, all day. I had a lot of things to do. So I didn't have any time to do any of the things you're worried about, Mom. Hmm. If you were busy, what are you doing here? Well, um, well, I forgot. It's been so long. Hits me again. You forgot? It was just today. Man, my mom is a violent lady. Still freezing up on the mountain. I, so a couple of my friends that I went to Japan with stayed longer than the rest of us. Um, and they were gonna go up to a mountain and try to do some snowboarding. But I'm not sure if they actually got to go, because I think, like, even in Japan, like, reaching the very end of the season. <gasps> what an antidote acquired. Where was that? I wonder what happened to Justin's stuff. Oh, hopefully it gets explained. Dear Diary, today I threw three cats into the old guy's yard. He got surprised and knocked over all his potted plants. I feel sort of sorry about what I did. So I've been thinking, next time, only one cat at a time. Yep, I really did think about what I did. Only one cat at a time. I'm not sure what I'm doing. How do I, like, waste time? Can I go to bed here? Is this a bed? No, it's my- yeah, it's mine. It's my diary. I wrote that. I wrote that. I'm not- it's not invading. I wrote it. Wow, Ragnats. Holy shit, that's fucking toxic. Justin, didn't your dad buy this map on the way to the, on the new continent? Um, isn't this New Parm? No, Sue. New Parm is over here. Invading <laughs> diaries is better. Well, let's go find my mom's diary. Although, does she have a room? Does she have a room? He's really an animal throwing psycho. Like, this is the, there's a restaurant down here, right? And then that's the living room, and then I have a bedroom. But does my mom not have a bedroom? Okay, don't go in there, she gets mad. Can I have that? Today's specials. Blackout lunch set, Squid King Sea Urchin Curry, Shark Pilaf, Dragon Salad, How 
do I waste time? Is that toaster? In a cr oh no, that's like the stash. Oh no, the stash. You want all of them? Which I don't. I mean, which one's the best here? I'd have the curry, I think. The sea urchin curry. Yeah, that sounds that sounds good for me. Dragon salad, <laughs> like a mix of little different dragons. Yeah, all dragon types. How do you waste time? Take two hours to find a sword. Unreal. The sword was in the chest, green. It was in the chest, which I thought it kind of was. Hey, Sweetnox. Hi, Faye, how are you? Uh, I thought it was, I just didn't know how to get it. So this is, um, this is a stash. So I can just throw shit in here. But that doesn't help me. You made a Dorito salad one time? All different Doritos in one bowl. Doesn't Doritos sell a bag that's like roulette? Um, where you, one, like every one in 10 is spicy or something? Isn't that real? Is that real? Uh, how did you open the chest? So Tense had it, the, the child had the key. No, if, when I try to leave the house, she's like, oh, we should hide for longer. Maybe I, I'll try leaving again. Yeah, the, the kid had, had the, um, had the key. Yeah, wait, Justin, if we go out now, they'll catch us. So I don't, how do I waste time in here? Should I try talking to my mom again? She's just gonna hit me again. Diced dragon, boiled eggs, a little mayo, a little mustard, salt and pepper to taste. Maybe some paprika, Demo? <laughs> Face the pain. Okay. Don't be saying silly things. Just tell me the truth about what you did today, Justin. I wasn't doing anything, ask Sue. Even I can't get into mischief, mischief every day, right? Is that right, Sue? That's right, Aunt Lily. Justin didn't do anything bad today. You, you gotta believe me. Really? Y yeah. Well, he wasn't nearly as bad as the day before yesterday. Why the hitting? Why still hitting? Vodcap. Get Hello. Forget that. No. Who are you and what are you doing in my following list? What are you talking about? You've been here for 21 months. Vodcap, thank you for the 21 months. It's good to see you again. I hope you've had a great last week and a half without me. I hope you're doing well. Hi, Fifth. Hello. Yeah, maybe she hits you enough. You'll black out and wake up the next morning. Valid strategy. Literally never heard of you before. Literally has a founder's badge. I thought so. Didn't I tell you to tell the truth? I just can't believe this kid. You listening? I don't know what you did, but don't get into any mischief that gets other people angry. Come on, let's have dinner. I tried out a new dish. Why don't you join us, Sue? But is it okay eating here every day? Didn't I tell you before? You can eat here whenever you want. Both of you, come upstairs. All right, let's have dinner with mom. They went to Japan and never came back. What is that? Symbol over my head. Today, the curator of the museum came to have lunch here. Funny, he always brings a sack lunch. Oh yeah, he asked me to tell you something. He wants you to go over to the museum tomorrow. He said he wants to return something that you left with him. I hope it's not this, I hope it's not some of that junk again. Oh, is that the junk that's in my room? Wait, what does this do? What am I doing? What's this? You two, don't eat so fast or you'll choke. I've been running so much, I'm starving. That was a real adventure, huh? But you know, 
My ancestors all had much greater adventures. Look at their pictures on the wall. Justin, is that your dad? My dad, my dad, my dad, my dad. The one on the end? Sure is. Someday I'll put on my I'll put my own picture with the rest. Right next to Dad's picture. Is he dead? Try eating some more, Justin. A first-rate adventurer has got to eat when he can. Can I try guessing what you left with the curator? Was it the spirit stone from your dad? A spirit stone? Your dad was not the kind of man to lie. But that being a spirit stone... But you know, when I first met him, he always wore it around his neck. It was really special to him. Wow, can you tell me about how you and Justin's dad first met, please? We first met on board a ship, on a night with no moon or waves. It was a very quiet night. Did you hear that, Justin? It was a quiet night on the sea. How romantic. But suddenly, pirates appeared and took over your dad's ship in the wink of an eye. Wow, a terrifying turn of events. Come on, what happened then? The leader of the band of pirates got a look at the spirit stone that your dad wore around his neck. The pirate drew a sword and said, Give me that stone. But your dad obstinately refused. Wow, that's just like dad. What happened then? Struck by the courage of your dad, the pirate leader decided to give up being a pirate on the spot. Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay. My dad's very powerful. Very powerful. I'll tell you in a moment, Ragnats. I'll tell you in a moment. The pirate that attacked dad. What was he like? Maybe a strong man of the sea type? Men of the sea? Are they men of the sea? <laughs> Not at all. The pirate was a girl just your age. A beauty named Lily the Skull. Isn't this woman's name Lily? <laughs> I've heard that name somewhere. Hmm, Lily. Lily. Ha, huh. Lily, that's you, Mom. <laughs> you finally noticed. I was pretty young then. I did a lot of things I regret. Wait, so she was the pirate? Okay, let's keep going. I never knew that you were a pirate, Aunt Lily, but it makes me admire you more. It's embarrassing, so don't go telling the neighbors, okay? They pretty much all know anyway. My mom was a pirate. Huh. Don't you want to eat anymore? If you want seconds, we have plenty left. I'm full. That was delicious. I'm full. Say, Justin, we're going to see the curator tomorrow, right? Don't forget. I have not forgotten. Hey, July. How are you? Happy Wednesday. <clears throat> Not getting the small stream window above chat during ads. I can look into that. I'll look into that. All right. What was my favorite? What was my? What was my favorite meal in Japan? So the last night we were there, we went to a sushi omakase restaurant um, in Tokyo. Uh, I forget the name of it, but it has one Michelin star. It was about 20 courses of sushi, and it's the best thing I've ever eaten in my life. That meal, best thing I've ever eaten in my life. I can no longer eat sushi. Uh, sushi is ruined for me now. So, yeah, it was 20. I mean, each course was like a piece. A piece of sushi was a course. But, yeah. Yep. It was the best thing I ate. Still in work office. I hope work is going okay, July. Hope it's going well. Good morning, Justin. Are you ready to go? Ah, uh, yes. Can never go back to American sushi. No, it's trash. It's trash. Even the sushi that we got at like, um, like a grocery store there, like the to-go 
sushi that we got. Like, miles better. You know, like, the worst sushi there is equivalent to the best sushi here. Or the best, like, everyday sushi. So, yeah. Can he sushi, sushi for, like, a month? Yeah, probably same vibes. Okay, uh, we have to go to the curator. Who are you? Say there, justy boy. Don't you think there's a lot more army guys around? I hear they're here to excavate ruins. Cut out the justy boy stuff. I'm not a child anymore. It's Justin. J-U-S-T-I-N. Oh yeah, sorry about that. Anyway, there might be treasure in the salt ruins, eh, justy boy? <laughs> I give up, sir. Justy boy. That's Sue's house. Should we talk to Sue's parents? You would never want to be called Justy Boy? It's not great. It's not great. Hey there, Justin. Thanks for playing with Sue all the time. I'm just playing. There's no need to thank me. But Sue was always having dinner over at your house. It must be a burden on Lily. I'm usually pretty crude. So Mom is really happy when Sue comes over. She's like a daughter to her. Oh my, it's Justin. You're taking care of Sue. Always helps us out. I worry that Sue might be getting sad since her parents passed away. Oh, this is not her parents. With you two, aunt and uncle, I'm not sad at all. Don't forget that I'm tougher than Justin. Oh yeah, you are. Sure. Er, Sue, you've got some mouth. Okay. Orphan Sue. We have Orphan Sue. Is that her teddy bear? That looks... That doesn't look great. <laughs> Batman Sue? Orphan Sue. She is Batman. Ew! This is coffee! How can people drink this bitter stuff? They say that children can't appreciate the taste of coffee. Justin, you're still a child. But Sue, why do you have coffee in your room? Sue, can you appreciate the taste of coffee? Wombat says hydrate. Wombat is cool. <clears throat> that must be my uncle's doing. If he wants to drink behind my aunt's back, he always uses my room. If he wants to drink behind my aunt's back, it's coffee. Is that... Okay, you're drinking coffee behind her back. Mm-hmm, coffee. <gasps> Stop, don't touch Betty. Betty's hibernating now, just leave her alone. She's pretty carefree, just like that goose. That, that goose? That goose. Oh, so it's not, oh, okay. It's not actually coffee. Right, yes. Hard coffee, adult coffee. They just didn't want it to be liquor. Gotcha. Gotcha. Cider bars instead of bar bars. Bar bars. Um, yeah, ba back to food. Let's get back to food talk a little bit. The food in Japan, top notch. Like any hole in the wall, and they're all hole in the walls. Carol, have a wonderful lurk. Um, they're all hole in the walls because everything is like small, right? So most of the restaurants sit only like eight people, eight-ish people. And it's just like a bar top and you're, you're sitting there and the kitchen is directly in front of you and they make the food there and they just hand it to you. Um, all just so good. A one, two, three, a one, two, three. Right foot in, right, left, left, lift hand lightly and turn. Say there, what you doing? That's some kind of game? Show me how to play. You're so silly, Justin. She's just practicing her dance. Is that a waltz? From herbs to weapons and armor, we have everything for you. Welcome to the general store. I do not want to go to the general store. I'd like to go to the museum. What are you doing here? Hey Justin, you know the seven wonders of Parm? 
Uh, no, what are they? I've never heard of them. Tell me what they are. They've been seeing ghosts lately at night near Port Road. Mom said she saw them too. What does that have to do with the Seven Wonders of Harm? Ghosts? One, one of the Ace Attorney games heavily revolves around a bottle of grape juice. Yeah, fermented <laughs> grape juice that they've let go, go bad, let's say. Come on, come on, gather around. Right now, the Blue Marlin restaurant is running a terrific special offer. Right now, we will even give you free warm bread with your meal. You won't find this offer anywhere. What's this bunk? We do that every day at the Seagull restaurant. That might be, but at the Blue Marlin, it's a great deal. The bread is usually cold. Does this game have jelly donuts? I don't know. Not yet. Yay, cold bread! Yay! Wait, I just went, I don't want to go this way. I want to be across this bridge. Giant seagull! Seagull restaurant, it is your restaurant. Where's the museum? I know the factories help the town prosper, but can't they do anything about the sit on laundry? Mom says exactly the same thing. But my husband works at the factory, so I guess I can't complain. Uh, back from your workout. Did you miss anything story-wise? Uh, my mom's a chef who hits me on the head and also used to be a pirate. Hearing seagull takes me out of work mode? <laughs> Just say seagull and you are summoned. <clears throat> Jelly Donuts is a Pokemon anime reference. Yeah. Unclear where dad is. Yes. Dad, not sure if dad is alive. But he has a spirit stone. And we're looking for the museum. Wow, that is a huge clock. But the time is wrong. Sort of hot if you get too close. Oh, we've got an accent here. We've got an accent coming on. Breath of Fire fishing vibes? Aye, it's ye. Justin, are you here to interrupt me in invention work again? <laughs> Why not? You don't have anything better to do, right? Don't worry, sir. I'll make sure Justin doesn't bother you. Oh, that's it? Me steam engine food processor. Cuts up all the ingre ingredients for you. The culinary tool of the future. Unfortunately, it's hard to get her to cut only the ingredients and not the cutting board too. Oh, as you see, her only drawback is that she cuts up the cutting boards too. Ha ha ha. Isn't that sort of a fatal drawback? Mr. Inventor, what's this machine used for? It keeps blowing out hot air. That's what I call me a hair dryer. I use steam power to make hot air to dry your hair. I keep making prototypes, but they all have the problem of soot mixed in the hot air. I don't think that's the problem. Air this hot will just burn your hair off. Okay, well this guy's cool. I hope he builds me something awesome that I use in the future. Mr. Inventor has no neck. Doesn't need one. Okay, what does this say? This way to the Ball Museum. It's called the Ball Museum? It's named after the bad guy? Well, I guess I don't know he's a bad guy. Museum is open for visitors from the general public. All right. Inventor of Chaos. Is this the museum? Oh, it's you, Justin. Come to play at the museum again? Don't make trouble for the curator. Today I didn't come to play. I came to get something back that I had left with the curator. Hmm. I didn't hear that a strange stone shard. What? Didn't I hear that a strange stone shard that your dad had was at, was the spirit stone? That's right. No one believes it though, but I'm sure the curator will, will prove that it's the real thing. Okay, spirit stone. Welcome to Jet, the Great General Ball Museum, dedicated to the advancement of national archaeology. Why, it's Justin and Sue. Welcome. Have you come to talk to the curator? Uh, yes. Wow, these floors are shiny. Look at that.
In the ancient times of old, the spirit stone symbolized blessings bestowed on Ikarians by spirits. The Ikarians generously shared the blessings of the spirit stone with the humans who then began to prosper. However, as the people began to desire even more prosperity, their greed began to cloud the spirit stone. Eventually, the stone broke into seven pieces, and the Ikarians and spirits departed, ending the mythical age. We have mysticism, not a religion yet. All right, I've memorized it. Now I know the Angelou myth perfectly. Think they'll hire me now? Oh, you don't work here? I don't want to talk to you. This spirit stone replica was created using ancient writings in the ruins. The prevailing theory holds that the spirit stones represent power, but another theory holds that the ancients exchanged other beautiful minerals as money among themselves, giving rise to a monetary economy. <laughs> yeah, right? He just hangs out. He just hangs out and hopes to get fired. Let's get hired. Sorry. Okay, are you... Look at all this shit. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. What is that? Artifacts of the Anjalu civilization sometimes include non-human statues that also have wings attached. Oh, this guy screams boss battle. I mean, not right now. They haven't even taught me how to do fighting yet. We've been playing this game for what, two hours? We haven't even done fighting yet. This is thought to mean that the ancients tended to consider the wings themselves to have godlike character. Wings originally symbolizing those in power came to acquire godlike status as wings themselves because became worshipped. Okay. The, these humanoid statues with wings attached are typical of those that are called Ikarian statues. This is thought to be a motif of the kings who had nearly a godlike presence, nearly godlike, uh, to the ancient people. This one just hanging out this one's my favorite super chill i should talk to this dude but i'm gonna read this first many such giant stone statues have been excavated from the ruins these stone statues are thought to have been meant to protect the kings buried there after their death however in almost every case there is no evidence that these kings were actually buried in the ruins hello hey mr curator Hello, Mr. Curator. Oh, you came just in the right time. Look, Justin. It's a new Ikarian statue. I just finished, finished its restoration. What is that? Wow, is this a statue of an Ikarian? I've never seen this type. Yes, when I checked with Gar Garlisle, it seems that it was found at the Dawn, Dawn Ruins on the new continent, Alencia. Wow, the Dom Ruins, eh? The biggest ruins on the new continent of Valencia. I'd like to go. I bet you would. Bet you would. Yes, it's what you look for that makes you a man, Justin. According to the Angelou myths told in Palm, Ica Icarians used the power of spirit stones to create a dream world. Dream world? Stories are told of floating cities and ships that travel to the stars. Wait, this was in, there were floating cities in the opening video. I paid attention. I paid attention. Steam engines that run forever. The spirit sanctuary frozen in time. Great immortal priests who never age. We got priests. Are you two finished yet? Sorry, Sue. We'll be through in a minute. Okay, but just a minute. After all... I'm a very understanding woman, right? Yeah, okay. <laughs> Yet, if we consider these utopian fantasies apart from myths, these Akarians must have been thought of as kings who possessed great power. Archaeology, that much is certain. No, archaeologically, these kings must have created the spirits and spirit stones in order to justify their presence. Hi, Gold, how are you? How have you been? Thank you for the welcome. 
Ah, oh, that's not very interesting. Archaeology has no romance. Ha ha ha. Sorry about that. I like dreamy stories myself. Justin, I guess you get bored when ancient myths come become research. That's right. I can't quite get in the mood today. It might all have been true, right? That's right, Justin. I cannot prove that it is not all true. Oh no, I almost forgot. It is about the so-called spirit stone left by your dad. Where is my dad? Who is my dad? Yeah, I did. I met up with Mark. We went out, um, went out, we went out one night and had some drinks. And then the next day he toured me around Osaka a bit. I got to meet him. I did. He's real. So you examined it for me? I bet it was real. Ha ha ha. I can't tell if it is real or fake. To begin with, the spirit stones only exist in myths. I tried to do a chemical analysis of the stone, but I couldn't. It is harder than diamond, so I gave up. Harder than diamond? Really? Until I think of another way to analyze it, I'll give it back. Spirit stone acquired? I didn't think it would be that easy. If you like, why don't you try analyzing it, Justin? I'll give you some hints. When you are finished looking at the statue, come to my office. I have something for you. Okay. Yeah, it was it was nice. It was nice to get to meet Mark. I also met um, Bimu, who is also a streamer. Bimu TV. <laughs> Jake. We have the spirit stone. Roll the credits. GG. GG's, we have the spirit stone. I guess we're done now. Uh, it was, yeah, I had a really great time. I had a really good time. It was, it was nice. I don't know. I really like, I really like traveling. So everywhere I go somewhere new. It's fun. The curator, the curator has hope for me. Mysteries of the ancient civilization. Justin the adventurer will solve them. I did already look at these things. Any books? Ruins of the Angelou civilization have produced many statues that were neither animal nor human. If these things were really portrayed in the statues exactly as they were, it'd be incredible. Uh, I'm gonna assume he lives this way. 91, that's pretty, pretty heckin' decent, Jackson. Oh, no, I already did, I already did mine. I already did mine earlier, I was 94. 96% clean. <laughs> Very clean. Very clean, my sin. Hella clean. Now, just where did I put it? Hmm, I can't remember. You said it was something good, so we got our hopes up, but you lost it? Of course not. I haven't lost it. <laughs> just let me remember. So go look at the Ikarian statue or something while I look for it. What? Dude. As the small fishing harbor that was Parm grew into today's new portal, uh, in today's portal to new continent. Wait, I, I'm having problems reading today. Reading is bad today. You want his poster? The, like, the dinosaur head thing? As the small fishing harbor that was Parm grew Stay. into today's portal to new continent, advances in steam engines have also made the factories prosper. Mostly the jewel factory where I work. I say this not because I work there. Hey, Mangzors, how are you? Thank you for the sub. Thank you so much. I'm so used to reading kanji now, I cannot read kanji. I cannot. I bet he says that just because he works there. The economic development of Parm is inseparable from the presence of the modern jewel factories. I'm just gonna look through his shit. I know he told me to leave. The steam engine, the greatest technology known to man, essential for trains, steamships, and factories. I absolutely hate that this game doesn't use Oxford commas. I gotta let it go. I gotta let it go. It's fine. What's this? Good, good. Glad to hear it. I can teach you how to clean yourselves. Oh, no. What's the other 1%? Oh, I don't know. Those commas use up precious character slots? Tracksuit. 
I need them. I already looked at all of this stuff. Read more books. Other researchers believe the wings of the ancient Anjalu civilization were no more than dreams of the ancients. How can they say that without looking? I'll prove it if I have to dig up all the ruins in the whole world. The other 1% is Breakmaster. It's always there. Can't get rid of it. Uh, um, they say maps found in the ruins of the ancient or of the Anjalu civilization included accurate maps of the new continent. This produced a theory that Anjalu was a very advanced civilization. Very interesting. Hmm. Too bad the portions of the map showing the other side of the end of the world are torn off. Is this a flat earth world? This is now canon. <laughs> is this a flat earth world? Is there actually an end of the world? Developing the lore. Lore intensifies. What's this jar? <laughs> Please, no more flat earth. We don't need that again. Uh, da, da, da. Do you think he's ready now? Say, Justin, what does it say here? Read it to me. The archaeological meaning of Anjalu. Anjalu in archaeology, Anjalu. That's not the same sentence. Anjalu is the name of what we know as a country in ancient civilization. Anjalunians and Parmians. Anjalu culture and palm culture. Wait, what? Town of Anjalu and town of Parm. Comparing the names like this, you can e easily see that Anjalu is considered to be the name of an ancient country. The Anjalu myths now told in Parm may be myths told in the ancient civilization that have survived. An alternate theory holds that the ancient civilization survived to the present in the form of myths. Many mysteries remain, such as how the spirits and Ikarians of myth relate to the ancient Anjalu civilization. This place is just Lord Um. I guess it's a museum. Look, look, Justin. The sun has a face. Pretty funny, huh? Is this the golden sun? I think we found it. We have finally found the golden sun. It's here. This is it. You're right. If the sun had a face like this, it could talk, huh? But... If that were true, this face would be watching us wherever we, whenever we were outside. Yo! <laughs> hmm, you're right. I like the sun the way it is now. Okay, let's just see if this dude's done. Just like in Teletubbies. Now. Just where did I put it? I can't remember. Wait. Okay, he actually wants me to look at the statue. That is not a question for me, Demo. But if anyone knows, maybe I look at this thing. The legendary Ikarian statue discovered at the Dom ruins. Hmm, I can picture that. Justin, I'm amazed you knew that the Dom ruins are the largest ruins on the new continent of Alencia. Of course I know. An adventurer needs to know lots of things. But you know, it's no fun just listening to other people's adventure stories. Alencia is awaiting me with mountains of exciting things. Just look. Oh, fuck. I thought I was going to ruin it. Someday, I'll find the Anjalu that no one else has been able to discover. Oh, I did ruin it. I ruined it. They're gonna kick me out of the museum. <laughs> Thank you for the clip. <gasps> what? What are you doing, Justin? Puff, 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 puff. No, no, just calm down. The only thing I can do is fix it. Sue, come on, help. No way. It won't work. We should just be honest and apologize. I can't do it. You saw how happy the curator looked when he restored the statue. He's not gonna give me this. He's gonna want his stone back. He's not gonna tell me shit now. I can't tell him. I remember what it looked like. Mm. 
No. That's not right. You sure that's right? I think it looked a little different. Maybe. But it's about 70% right, don't you think? On a test, that's a passing grade, right? Oh, no. That's not the point, Justin. Fuck was that? What the fuck was that? Hello? Hey, Roy, how you doing? How you doing? How you doing today? A uh, Bahamar one? Okay, wait, though. Justin, there's still something wrong. Don't worry. I know a little about Angelou's civilization. Am I just gonna leave it? Like that? I guess I leave it like that. We're doing well in here. Uh, it's, it's new game day. I always love new game day. All right. Oh, here it is. I was keeping it in my pocket, so I would always be ready to give it to you and see your smiling face. It was in your pocket the whole time? <laughs> Mr. Curator, are you getting senile in your old age? <laughs> You're never at a loss for words. Anyway, I just heard a loud crash. Did something happen? Oh, that wasn't me. That wasn't me. I was here the whole time. That wasn't me. What? What do we do, Sue? Think we should tell him the truth? Maybe. Yeah, you figure it out. I don't know what to do. Come on. Say something, or he'll know something's wrong. Oh, I'm gonna tell him. I'm gonna tell him. Later, Night Sprite. Thank you so much. Have a great rest of your day. <laughs> I bet it was the Flat Earthers. Okay, I'm gonna tell him, I'm gonna admit. Ha ha ha, Justin, you are a joker. If you broke the statue I just finished repairing, my poor heart couldn't take it. Fuck, have I killed this man? Have I killed this man? Putting aside the jokes, I have something good for you. Cool, what is it? Oh, he doesn't even, he doesn't believe me. Ha ha ha, my present to you is this. Letter of introduction acquired. The Garlisle forces are searching the salt ruins again. I arranged for two people to visit. Wow, really? Thank you, Mr. Curator. This is very kind of him. Very kind of him. Dr. Goldfire, thank you for the prime sub. I really appreciate that. I hope you're having such a good day. Thank you very much. And thank you for the follow. Isn't this great, Justin? You kept saying that you wanted to go to the salt ruins. Puff, puff. I'm just happy to see your faces. Show this letter of introduction and the army will let you visit. Justin, you go find out yourself if the spirit stone is real or not. Okay. Do we go check out if we ruined that thing? Oh no, wait, what was that smash smash? That's still together. I thought it had fallen. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, this game has a run. This has been here the whole time. You know what? I'm actually proud of myself. This is probably the earliest in a game that I've discovered that I can run. I'm doing well. Phew, we made it. Think we got away clean? <laughs> oh, the Arkarian statue! I just finished fixing it. Uh-oh. We're in deep stuff now. What'll we do? You think we should go back and apologize? <laughs> you think you for the awkward puppet, Jake? You think we should go back and apologize straight out? Maybe the curator will forgive. Who was it? Who did this? Now I have to work day and night to fix it all over again. Nope. No way. If we go back now, he'll take back the letter of introduction for sure. You're right. I feel bad about the curator, but let's come back and apologize later. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. 
for sure. Okay. I have not fully explored this town. Uh. Wait. I'm not ready. I'm not ready to leave. We told- that's true. I did tell him. I did admit it. Okay, that's leaving. I would love a mini-map. I don't think we're getting one. No, we- I haven't even fought anything. I've never fought anything. I know there's a- okay. Oh shit. This is leaving too. Okay, just just, just you wait. Just you wait, game. I'm not ready. I I was I don't even So That's the Marlin place. Is that garbage bin? That's my mom's restaurant. That's Sue's house. What else is here? No battle. There's been no battling. Also, I know there's a third party member. There's someone with green hair. I saw them in I saw them in the art. Oh, speaking of green hair. Speaking of green hair. We, we love a green-haired baddie. I, I was thinking about it because there's a lot of green-haired characters. Um, we, you know what? Fuck it. I'm just gonna go the mark. I'm gonna go the road. We need to plan a cosplay. We need to pick a cosplay. Um, oh, there's a safe spot right there. Okay, we need to pick a cosplay. So if you have any ideas, throw them in the Discord, and we're gonna do a poll for what cosplay I put together. Uh, one of the subathon goals that we've reached was like building a new cosplay. This game has a long time in between save points. I have some ideas that I'll probably throw out there, but if you have anything good that you want me to dress as, that you think would be fun. Oh, let's do a battle. Our very first battle. Okay. Ambushed. Uh, I'm gonna need a, this is good. I'm gonna need a minute. We should do a cosplay for a character of a future tale stream that decides your first tales game. Trash Randcoot cosplaying as Batman, cosplaying as Mycin. That is a lot. Okay, so it looks like we have like a, a turn order at the bottom. Combo, critical, bend, look. Escape, tactics, items, moves, magic. We don't have any moves or magic. I love how I can choose to get a critical hit. I don't know. Let's just try a combo. You too? Oh, it's a, that's a little hectic. All I'm right, not sure won. that I took in everything that happened there. We got two experience though. And we acquired skills? Skills acquired. No. Wait. Do I have skills? Oh, that's true. Yeah, I'm gonna go read that hint. That's a good call. Good shout. Monster encounters. Touching a monster starts combat. You may get an advantage in combat depending on how the monster is touched. Touch your monsters in different ways, people. Touch them in different ways, different things might happen. It's advantageous to touch the rear most of a group of monsters. All right, here we go. Touch the monsters in the butt. Also, take note of the monster colors. If a monster is not shining red, it has not seen you yet. If you touch a monster before you are seen, you have the initiative. No, this does. this is not consensual touching. It is not. 
Um, try approaching them from out of view. You may also be ambushed and have a disadvantage if a monster touches an ally from the back. Right, touch their butts, don't let them touch your butts. Let's try it again. Show me a monster. That's not a monster. What's that? Oh, that's a monster. Oh no, he saw me. Shit. I was trying to. Oh, I wanted to. I wanted to touch his butt. But we've been ambushed again. Okay, I'm gonna try a different uh, thing. So. Critical. <laughs> Did not protect the butt. I wonder if what I do. Huh! <gasps> you do have moves! Wait, SP? Oh, moves cost SP, magic costs MP. Do a puffy kick. Do it. Well done. I think. It still, this still happened very, um, that happened very quick. Battle is very quick. Skills acquired. Let's get this herb thing. Uh, I did not protect my butt. Yeah, they touched it. Touched it. Although, how was that? I didn't feel like that should be an ambush. Like, I knew he was coming. I was, I was spying on him. Auto. I was spying on him and they touched me. I'm assuming that's a full heal. You turned around and presented the butt? If they touch Sue, it's an ambush. Right, the rearmost party member. Okay. Look at that gold! Oh, touch. This is a lot more dudes. No, still just two? Yeah, yeah. It's a full heal. We're gonna we're doing some testing here. Crit on them. Combo? On them? Very hectic. Nice. Did I do good? I'm gonna get this gold. Okay. Touch. Not an ambush. But I haven't figured out. I didn't get ambushed. Oh no! Wait. I have the initiative. Let's try this. Let's do a rah rah. Oh wait, I didn't even see what that did. Come on, puppy! Rah rah Let's go! Here we go! Perfect. That was probably exceptionally unnecessary. Um, do a V slash. Not only do a single target, a multi target. When, what did that do? Oh, that's a heal. I did a heal. That's silly of me. Too accurate, Jake. That's that is too accurate All of a right, statement. We won. Okay. Yay! Go us. Can I have that gold now? Oh, we get like some IP frames. Tell me the difference between a combo and a critical. I feel like it goes too fast for me to. Like both of them did damage. <laughs> no, 
Jackson just says no. Um, yeah, flamingo, because that's like a, it's like a technical thing. Yeah. Crit is one big hit, combo is multi-hit. Both are single target. Crit is slower. Makes sense. I keep forgetting I can turn the map. I also don't want to get lost. This music's pretty rad. <gasps> Snake. die here. I'm gonna try not to. So, am I better to crit on whoever's coming up next? Oh, crit pushes him down the ATV bar. Hey, Adel. It's going well, thank you. How are you? Only if they're between command and act. Gotcha. That All makes right, sense. We I, I hear you. I want time to time the crit when the enemy has their move. Does the game tell you that at any point? Hmm. Eventually? Yeah, fair. The game wants you to learn how to manipulate the action bar. That makes sense. That does make sense. Sibling so FF5, how is it going? Oh, is it in the instruction booklet? That's fair, that's fair. Okay, um, it's after one o'clock. I'm gonna call it here for today. This has been good. This has been a good start, I think. Yeah? Decent start? I've, I've had a good time. I've had a good time. <laughs>